Hey, what's up YouTube? Welcome to my channel. My name is Mike Andrade. Today I'll be doing something different. Um, today I'll be doing a tutorial about my gym. Um, the other day somebody made a comment on one of my shorts when I was doing burpees. He said it looks like I have I work out inside my pantry. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah, it kind of does look like a pantry because honestly, it's my pantry. Not my. It's not my pantry. It's my gym room slash office slash laundry room kind of slash pantry but it is what it is man um here it is this is also luna bear's room so this is what it looks like this is where she sleeps that's her bed right there right but let's get a view from out here here's my laundry room area so it's a little bit unorganized today's laundry day um here's my first pull-up bar that i made my office space i have an office i plan to update all this just so you guys know so i'm gonna be quick on the tutorial on the tour whatever you want to call it this is my bench press that i use you could this marcy cage here has what comes with a pull-up bar dip bars safety rails here and here that you can adjust higher or lower depending on whether you're bench pressing or squatting then you got these uh ones here that you can adjust to for the squat rack this one's facing the other way but you can flip it over on this side and it's your squat rack or your bench press uh, i got attachments for like the triceps um bicep curls and pull down lateral for the cables up here so i got all those attachments for the weights i got the old sand plates i don't really use those just kind of keep them here to weight down the machine so it doesn't move a lot but i got these plates right here these two metal ones are 20s and then the gray ones on the outside are 25s i got plenty of fives everywhere i pretty much use the fives for everything and then these are all my tens right here so um i don't really use this as a bench press just because there isn't enough space between the end of the cage here and that cabinet um so i don't really do heavy bench pressing to begin with when I squat, I use this bad boy right here. This is a squat rack that I use. It doesn't have much of the safety rails. It's not like those are going to help you do anything. But I'll bring this out and I'll set it up right here facing this way. So I can squat facing this way. And I got all this space here to do so. Um, that one comes really handy, man. I love this little squat rack. I also have this treadmill that i use every other day i use it on cardio days which is tuesdays thursdays and sundays i love this treadmill i love that you can pull it up and it saves you all this space here got my punching gloves i got this stationary bike which i don't really use because that little knob that is used to adjust the tension of the wheel is not really working so i think i'm gonna get rid of this and i'm gonna put a nice weight rack from here to there where i could start adding more heavier weights Cause I have these little bad boys right now. I use these for like boxing routines. You know, they're 15s, 10s, 8s. And you got the 3s and the 2s for shadow boxing. You got a 20 pound heavy heavy medicine ball back there. And uh, desk area, which I plan to uh, update. Like I said, this is where I run all my business. So I'm just currently just using my laptop, screen share, unfiled, and work pending. And all this uh, file cabinet um little desk area is a little messy i know but that's the life of a businessman i plan to put one of those electronic desks that you can raise up and you can work standing up or you can raise it back down and you can sit back down in the chair i plan to put new windows in i'll be framing in all those shelves back there so you don't have to see any of that i'm thinking of putting mirrors on the bottom end of this wall as well as removing those cabinets there framing a soffit there for that vent i plan to also frame in this furnace as well as the water heater and what happened here was i bought two new a washer and dryer but the washer stopped working for some reason and long story short i got these two up here these stacked ones and work magnificent man i love these so once i get rid of these two i'm gonna give them away to my brother i'm gonna frame in a closet space from this washer over to that wall where i have a nice clothes hanger and shelves all the way underneath so i can organize all my shirts and all my t-shirts and pants and everything and that'll look a little bit nicer so 
This is my company, by the way. I didn't plan to introduce my company to this channel just yet, but if you want to check it out, you can check out the website. It's a little outdated, a little boring, but definitely Instagram I'd recommend. If you want to go follow me on Instagram, you can do that. It's Andrade underscore constructions, and I got all my latest work on there. Fresh paint. I plan to do fresh paint and then some sort of simple epoxy flooring and just be able to clean it up every day. I try to come in here and mop my floors every other night. I got these Bowflex adjustable weights that can be maximum adjustment weight could be 52 pounds and a half. And the lowest is five pounders, which I don't really see the use for. I also got this hydro bag here. I love this thing, man. I, I got to be hitting the punching bag on cardio days after I do jump rope. I do this. Well, actually, jump rope is just on my workouts. I split my workouts Monday, Wednesdays, Fridays is push, pull, leg. And then between those days, which is Thursday, Tuesday, Thursday, I skip Saturday and workout Sunday is my cardio days. I try to use the treadmill for cardio days and I warm up with my jump rope on the regular days. Monday's push, Wednesday's pull, Friday legs. Today's Thursday, so tomorrow I'll be setting this bad boy up here and I'll be squatting tomorrow using the leg extension machine here. You could also do uh, hamstring curls with this machine. And then I'll show you this cool trick. I'll upload a, a short on how I managed to use this machine as a calf calf machine it's kind of complicated but i take that little ah uh, you can't see it i don't even know where it's at actually it's a little bench that i set right here and i put weights on top like here and i'm pushing up but it, it's it's kind of harder to explain now so i'll just upload that short just so you kind of get an, an idea so like i said let me know what you guys think of my little home gym setup it's pretty simple it's pretty outdated but you know what I'm glad to be here. I love this gym. This is the job for me. I feel good. I feel amazing. As long as I'm working out, I feel great, man. And honestly, you don't even need a lot of space. You just need a couple weights. You could get yourself a perfect pull-up. Everyone's got doors. Everyone's got door trims. You can hang up a pull-up bar there. You just need a jump rope, some running shoes. You could go run yourself. You got body, your own body weight. You could do push-ups. You could do squats. You could do burpees you could do push-ups you could do crunches all kinds of exercise man there's no excuse to why people shouldn't be working out so this is my gym plain and simple as it is i plan to update it if you guys think you guys have any suggestions or let me know what you guys think about my gym in the comments below on what i can possibly do to make this thing look a little better besides organizing all this i'm kind of ashamed to show all this but you know what i think i figured that that would make pretty cool content if i show you guys what it looks like now and what it could look like later if i get serious about dropping this content man i'm a busy man but you know what if if i could get people interested enough to come see my stuff i'll be glad to put on important content here inspire other people to you know work on themselves and improve their lives and self-master themselves and start manifesting blessings into their life because that's what i'm here for man I'm here to teach you guys that it's possible. I'm here to motivate. I'm here to inspire. We all have to start somewhere. We don't all get to start at the top. You know, no one gets dropped off at the top. Like, just like that. You have to work your way up, man. So this is me now. And I plan to progress. I plan to keep leveling up. Helping you guys stay motivated, focused, and committed. Because those are the keys to success, man. But, Jim, for now, I'm going to let you guys go. So let me know what you think. And I'll see you guys on the next video.